Gonna run to mama. Me and my dependent snakes. Go run to mama. Uh -huh. Oh, your nose is cold, Fade. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Yeah, I do. I want more like my dad than my mom. Wanna go see Veronica? I don't know if she's man enough to pick you up. I imagine she is, if I am. Oh, I helped Eddie move that car yesterday. Yeah. I don't think she wants to be picked up. <laughs> she will. It just depends on how secure you feel <sighs> picking her up. She's all right. Hey, you. Gripping my leg. Pure muscle, isn't she? So I'm going back to my mom. Mm -hmm. I want my mom. Where'd my mom go? See, where's my mommy? People say snakes don't have a, emotions, don't have attachments for people. I would have to disagree with you. You come back to mama. There's mom. There's mom. You're not supposed to bury yourself in the ground. Oh, forget all about my cat's blood. No, 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 no. Okay. Forget about my pet's leg, silly. She's long. She's a big girl. Every time I touch her, she moves. Yeah. Ugh. Pushing me away. Actually, she's using you for a catapult to go forward is what she's doing. Go see Veronica. Go see Veronica. Leave me alone. <laughs> go see Veronica. Come on. Go see V. Oh, see, there's that damn camera again. They does not like this thing. It's the only snake I've got that doesn't like the zoom lens on it. As soon as it goes in or out, she like backs up and wants to strike at it. Mama's baby. You're a mama's baby. Yeah, you are. Those pretty silver eyes. Are you happy now? That wasn't nice. Veronica wanted to hold you and you took off and left her. still on me. <laughs> Her eyes look like cookies and cream ice cream outdoors. It's cool. Go see V. Go with her. So, oh. No, we can't do that by ourselves. Ugh. How about that? You're kind of turned over here. Why are you flipped upside down? There you go. There you go. Wow, I'm outdoors again. This is so awesome. Mm -hmm. Mama's girl. All my snakes are spoiled brats. Yeah, I'm a spoiled brat. See, yes, I am. You're still not going to get around my neck, though. You're working hard trying. Yes, you are. It's not going to happen. No, it's not. It's not going to happen. <laughs> Keep rolling your back over. What? What? I, I, I tell people that all the time. You have to be secure when you handle your snakes. You know, if you approach them, and the only thing you got on your mind is, I'm going to get bit. Oh, Lord, I don't want to get bit. They know that. If you're not, you have to, I hate to say be in control, but you really have to be rigid and stern with them. Or they know you're weak, and they know you're afraid of them, and you're afraid of getting bit. And if they realize that, they're going to take advantage of it. You probably will. Because they can sense nervousness in a person. If you're stressed out or upset, they know it. That's why I tell people all the time, you know, don't be afraid to pick them up. Don't be able to break. They're rough animals. You can move them around roughly without hurting them. I mean, don't abuse them or, you know, wreck, be reckless with them. But, see, we're cool. Yes, we are. We're cool snakes. That pr she's got orange. Look at the orange dots on the belly. Getting ready to shed shortly, huh? Again. A couple of weeks. Because she ate a lot. Isn't that pretty orange? But so you got to not be afraid of us if you don't expect to get bit. Now, I found that over the years, the thing with snakes is if they know you, they don't intimidate you, you're a lot less likely to get struck at and a lot less likely to take a bite from them. If you're a coward and you're afraid of them and all you're worried about is getting bit, they know it. But if you take the initiative and you're firm with them and handle them, you know, 
relaxing handle them. You know, it's no different than picking up a cat or a dog or anything and handling them. Just relax when you approach them and stay relaxed when you handle them. And if you get bit, the last thing you want to do is freak out because you can break the snake's teeth out. And if the snake, you yank a snake off of you that's biting you, you can rip a lot of flesh and you'll end up going out in the hospital with stitches. So just relax with them. That's the best advice I can give anybody. Calm down, chill out, and relax. Don't stress out when you handle them. See, don't stress out. See, we're not bad animals at all. No, we're not. See, we're cool. <laughs> and you're very heavy. Yes, you are. <laughs> See, where's my mama? Where's my mama? There. Wanna go see Veronica? I don't know if Veronica can pick you up. <laughs> Here, wanna try her? There she is. She's coming to go see Veronica. There you go. That a girl. You calmed right down when I came over here. Is that better? Is that all better? Ooh. Hmm? There's that ladybug again. I'm trying to pick up a hitchhiker page. Hmm. You can't have my glasses. No. Hmm. You can have my glasses. I touched her and she moved. See, there's mom. There's mom. See, there's my. See, there's my mom. Yeah. I'm right here. Yeah. You're okay. Say, I found my mom. Huh. You okay now? Is it all better? Is it all better? Say, I found mommy. I'm fine. Who loves you? Huh? Who loves you? I love you, babe. Yes, I do. I love you. Mm.